Hello and good evening. Welcome to Stella. We finally made our way up through the mountain village and the city that was in ruins. And we were ooh, transported here by some means. Oh. Oh my. Flying power? Yes, please. Wee! Wow, the jump. I feel like got uh, higher. Ah. Oh. The little pyramids are scanning. Scanning for what? <laughs> I'm assuming you can't walk through that, but Zap Okay Seems as though you can jump over that Up, oh, please. Aha! <laughs> now we can be friends. Take me away, pyramid friend. I'll ride you to the sunset. Oh dear. Jumping is much more floaty this time. It's fine. Just gotta get a little used to it. Oh, he seems to be helping me out now. Oh! Just another test to ensure we are the one. Oh, was I supposed to wait or take a leap of faith there? Oh, one in the background. Okay. Wow. What a journey. Okay. Uh, let's just hurry up. Don't know if there was any right or wrong solution there. Um, hopefully I can go down here. Ooh. Yeah, you get some serious height. Sure. Rearrangement. I see. It's kind of like a back and forth situation. Well, we make our way always forward. Really like the colors. It's like a 
Aurora Borealis. Hmm. We have a green one. What does a green one do? It goes up. Up and up and up and up. Up and up. Thank you. And the switch. Rotates us around, but why would I need to do that? I don't know. And this switch. Flippy. Hmm. Okay, so what's confusing to me is that you can move the handles both ways. Like, they move left and right. Now, if left and right, it does, let's say it doesn't matter which one it goes, then it should only move one way. Like, I find that kind of frustrating. I could be wrong, as in left and right does affect it, but if it doesn't, then I find it very frustrating because in my head, like, I'm always thinking, if I move it left and it does something, and then in my head I'm thinking, well, what if I moved it right? So I'm constantly thinking, well, what if I did this? What if I did that? You know? So I'm only move. I'm I. I've decided I'm only gonna move it to the right. Be funny if you could just jump that, but of course not. And obviously, some people would not care about that. This goes all the way up. Okay. I think I had the solution there for a while. I just didn't do it. Oh. <laughs> oh, I, I'm so tempted to jump that. There's no way you can make that. Unless it's a speed running strat. Who knows? Zap. Eureka! Again, I was just turning things to the right. I, I don't feel- I don't know if I was actually solving the puzzle or I just got it by chance. Alright, on our way across this rainbow bridge. Where does it lead us? What will we find? Some platforms. Light them up. Whoa. This is how the iPod was invented. I know it, it, it's upside down. Okay. Oh. What are we making here? Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Please don't kill me. Hmm. No, I play a game like this, a flash game. Where you were like a little piece of gum and you had to climb this mountain. It's quite addicting. Oh, hi. 
Okay, okay. And now we're making our way down. Yeah, you're rotating around. Stairs, perhaps? Oh! I can do it! Hopefully I'm not supposed to be going down. What a weird game of Tetris. Look what approaches. Oh. Love the the sliding of the stones, just the sound it gives. Really nice. Oh, it's very difficult to see. Whoa. Oh, we're moving. reach the top final destination let's go what is our final destination a door to glow inside the gate. Well, hmm. What happened here? What is beyond the gate? Silence. Is this world too ruined? There is something in the distance. Some large structure. Oh. The mustached skulls came and weren't very happy. The people prayed, but the prayers weren't answered, perhaps? As they prayed, 
the sun, perhaps, I think, transformed them or a spell drove them mad. Until I came. the obelisks. I was led towards the eye through my trials. But well, what can I do to save this world? To undo a terrible curse, perhaps? Make the world whole again. One final sacrifice. I am become death. Reference to nuclear warfare? Wow. The sun was actually the power of the sun. Nuclear warhead. Wow. All right, so final thoughts. Uh, a short game with environment storytelling. The only criticism I have is the perspective was difficult to communicate and I don't even, again, I don't even know how you kind of fix that. You could probably blow through this in uh, maybe two hours-ish. I don't know, I think it was really well done. The soundtrack was amazing. It, uh, I think it's good for a younger audience for sure. Uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. What a, what a great little game, you know? It's, it's good. Story uh, is obviously left up to, to your interpretation. So, who knows? It, it's, it's for, it could be for anyone and everyone. Hope you enjoyed. See multiple suns. A large town, city, the wheel turns.